We've been talking a lot in recent times about trying to get to that best person uh, that you can be, get to the best possible version of yourself, reaching your potential. And one of the only ways that you can do that is by learning about yourself. And I'm not talking about, you know, learning about who you are on a deep level, but learning what makes you tick, um, learning what has made you tick in the past. Um, and it's only really when you can get to understand that to that level about yourself that you can really start to make progress in uh, changing those things because you know as I said in all of these videos it's not about the alcohol it's about what you do afterwards it's about um, moving towards a person that you want to be because if you stay the same person uh, if you try and live the same life that you lived while you were dr a drinker you're just going to be completely disenchanted with things um, you're not going to see yourself improving too much and uh, a lot of this ha has to happen on a on a deep level where you're you're um, getting down into who you are and what you're doing and um, you know reaching down from, on a, like I say on a, a basis of finding out what makes you tick you know we've talked about this as well that you know one of the the essentials of this early part of the journey is to think about yourself um, to think from your perspective because there is no collective liver there is no collective brain there is no collective uh, body that's going to die if you die you know when you poison yourself it's only you that that suffers the consequences of this I mean that other people suffer the consequences basically because of your actions but you know you suffer the direct consequences um, and so you know think about the uh, when you get onto any aeroplane and the stewardess or the steward or um, that person at the front with the uniform who is in charge of the plane they tell you you know to to um, uh, if the plane comes down and crashes, then you've got to put on that thing, the, the mask first, and you have to look after yourself before you look after your kids. Same thing here. If you don't look after yourself, you're no good for looking after anyone else. So, you know, there's a lot of ways that you can uh, learn about yourself. Um, I find one of the best ways is reading and taking courses and joining the right groups, like-minded people who are heading in the right direction. Um, it's easy to get sucked into rabbit holes these days especially with groups of people if you're um, you know if you're narrowing your uh, your mindset if you're narrowing your viewpoint um, the internet will show you exactly what you want it to show you you know YouTube will show you the exact videos that you're searching for uh, Facebook will do the same Twitter will do the same uh, the internet in general will do the same it will show you exactly what you are looking for so if you're um, if you're looking for a particular political persuasion or a religious persuasion, it will keep showing you those things and it won't show you the alternative. Um, and I think it's your job to, to seek out the alternative, to broaden your horizons and to look for other things in life. I think it's one of the only ways of really finding out who you really are. You know, just because you started out your life in a certain way, thinking a certain way, doesn't mean to say that you have to carry on with that uh, throughout your life. Um, you know, this is all about reaching your potential, getting to that best possible version of yourself, and you're never going to get there. Uh, you're never going to even be um, on the journey to getting there if you don't open your mind up to different things. And I'm not saying that you have to change uh, the way you, you know, your faith or anything like that, uh, but I'm saying um, open up your mind. You know, this shouldn't come down to politics or religion or anything like that should come down to you and your life and what's good for you and what's good for your family and what's good for um, getting you towards the best version of yourself um, if everyone did that if everyone tried to be the best possible versions of themselves imagine what society would be like it would be a completely different place um, I'm Kevin O'Hara for Habits V2 we help people to stop drinking alcohol and to try and find the best possible versions of themselves to get to that potential, to reach that potential, um, to at least get on the journey of that potential. Take care of yourself and I'll speak to you again. Onwards and upwards. Bye now.